sweet William, do you remember the first day that we met? We were at Mark and Carly's apartment for an early Easter dinner between friends. You walked in and I've been enamored by you ever since. I am so lucky that this was the beginning of a journey where every day I discover more reasons why I love you. I continue daily to find comfort in your strength, independence, and humor, and I am so very glad that you are mine. We're here. We're doing it. We're here and it's happening. You look even more breathtaking than I imagined you would. It was summer 2016, and after dating a few months, we borrowed your mom's one-of-a-kind, rust orange and rust covered Chevrolet HHR, and we drove it out to Manitoulin Island, just the two of us. We hiked the cup and saucer trail that morning, spotting numerous white-tailed deer, cooled off at the lovely and now ironically named Bridal Vale Falls afterwards, and finished the day off exploring the picturesque Gore Bay, whilst enjoying some fish and chips on the docks, looking out over Lake Huron. It was perfect. It was that day that I knew I had found someone truly special to me. I don't think we took a single photo. We just enjoyed the moment in each other's company. And of course, we laughed. A lot. On the docks that evening, I knew I was falling very much in love with you. This was one of the happiest days of my life. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. May I take this opportunity of welcoming you to this happy occasion, the marriage of Will and Megan. To you may extend a special welcome on this their wedding day. May I thank both Cecil parents for travelling all this way to make this day even more special. I give you this ring to wear with love and joy. As a ring has no end. And neither shall my love for you. I choose you to be my husband from this day and forevermore. Perfect timing. Your these rings are given as tokens that you both accept the status and responsibilities of marriage. By the declaration which you have both made before these witnesses and by the authority granted to me, it gives me much pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. And now you may kiss the bride. <laughs> I wanted to raise a glass to a toast to all of Megan and I's friends and family back home, our siblings, our nieces and nephews, and Grandpa Joe and Grandma Shirley. The support we've received from you guys has been absolutely incredible and we can't wait to celebrate our marriage with you. So cheers, thanks. As we embark on our journey together as husband and wife, I am so pleased to get to travel with a partner that appreciates me for all that I am. You bring out the absolute best in me and your kind and loving soul adds so much joy to my life. I need to thank you. Thank you for always loving me and accepting me for who I am. I know it can be frustrating hearing me complain about being hungry every couple of hours. Seriously though, Megan, I love you with all my heart, and I look so very forward to growing old with you.